Hi, I am Sayyad and you are watching Automotive Revolution. If you are new to my channel please subscribe. This video is about the evolution of seat 127 from 1972 to 1982. The seat 127 is a super mini produced by the Spanish automaker seat based on the Fiat 127. The Series 1 seat 127 was introduced in spring 1972. Body styling were three and five door hatchback and also due to seat design policy, a four door variant of the car without a hatchback lid, in spite of the fastback Rawfline was added to the lineup in 1973. Seat 127 was fitted with the same 903cc engine as in the Fiat 127. Seat also produced a unique variant of the 127 OHV engine. This had 1010cc instead of 903cc and produced 52 PS. Both engine were mated to 4-speed manual transmission. The seat 127 underwent the same styling modifications as did the Fiat 127 new grille, taillights, bumpers for the Serie 2 of January 1980. At the same time, a full five-door hatchback bodywork also became available. Once the license to the 127 had expired, seat develops a new version with a new name called Seat Führer, which was introduced in end of 1981 for the model year of 1982. It was available in three and five door hatchback body styles. It was available with the 903 cc OHV inline four engine having five speed manual transmission. The seat Führer Chrono was used in the Copa Führer One Make Rally series, which was launched in 1983 and terminated in 1985. The cars were tuned by Abarth and produced 90 PS. After the facelift of 1983, the seat Führer DOS was introduced. It didn't differ much from its predecessor mainly through smaller headlights and turn signals. Thanks for watching Automotive Revolution. Please subscribe my channel.